Hey everybody, it's your boy DMS coming at you from Sporticus 300. In this video, we're going to be covering March Madness. Teams in, teams out, teams on the bubble. Also, we do have a giveaway going on for this Lonzo Ball autograph card. Um, if you're interested in that, just be sure to follow us on Twitter and follow us on here. Once we hit 500 subscribers on Twitter, we will be giving it away. So let your friends know. Try to get our subscribers up. Like I said, once we hit 500, we're giving it away to one of our followers on there. But be sure to follow us on here as well. But let's go ahead and dive into this video. Let's talk about March Madness. Teams in, teams out. Let's get it. As you can see here, I got three different rows. Uh, the top row is locks. The middle row is should be in. And the bottom row is need a little bit of help. So we'll start with the locks here. You got Florida State, you got Virginia, you got Duke, you got North Carolina, you got Louisville, Virginia Tech, Syracuse should be in, Clemson and NC State. It's just a matter of their last few games in the tournament and um, what's been going on. Hopefully a couple teams can lose and maybe one of them will squeeze in. All right, to so the Big 12. Kansas, Texas Tech, Iowa State, Kansas State, and Baylor should all be locks. Um, there's no should be in here. You're talking about Texas, Oklahoma, and TCU that are looking for a little bit of help here. Um, either in the conference tournaments or just their um, last regular season game. If they can get a W there, it definitely helps their cause. But those teams are on the outside looking in, but they could be in. All right, next we got the Big East. And in the Big East, Marquette and Villanova are the only two uh, locks we have here. You got St. John's, Seton Hall, Creighton, Xavier, and Georgetown that are hoping for some prayers here. Um, none of them are locks in or should be in. Or should be in. They're all on the outskirts looking in, hoping for a good bounce their way in the conference tournament. Uh, a couple wins there might help solidify them. Then you hop over to the Big Ten. Your locks there are Michigan State, Michigan, Purdue, Wisconsin, Maryland, Iowa should be in, Minnesota, Ohio State, Indiana. They need some things to go their way in the conference tournament or their last regular season game. But other than that, like I said, they're on the outside kind of looking in, hoping for something to go their way. That way they can make it into the tournament here. Um, next up, we've got the Pac-12. And in the Pac-12, you only have Washington guaranteed in, and Arizona State should be in. They're hoping for some prayers their way. Uh, the American Conference... Houston's definitely going to be in, as, long, as well as Cincinnati and Central Florida. And Temple's on the outside looking in, hoping for some things to go their way in the conference tournament as well. All right, next up, you got the SEC. And with the SEC, you got uh, guarantees of Tennessee, Kentucky, LSU. It's terrible what's going on there. Um, but LSU, Mississippi State, Auburn are all guarantees. Ole Miss is, uh, should be in, and Florida and Alabama are on the outside looking in, hoping for some wins either in their last regular season game or in the conference tournament to get them going in the right direction. And last uh, list we're going to have, we're just going to list the teams in the NCAA that aren't in power conferences. But the guaranteed ends are uh, Gonzaga, Nevada, and Buffalo, with Wofford and BCU both should be in. Um, and the outside looking in, you got Lipscomb, you've got um, St. Mary's, you got Murray State, Belmont, Utah State, and Furman. And with those teams, um, they just need to hope something can go their way, either one in their conference tournament or just their last regular season games. But it's definitely time for everyone to turn up the heat. As you already know, if you win your conference tournament, you're automatically in the NCAA tournament, no matter how terrible you did the entire season. So some of these teams can definitely be looking for that kind of break in the NCAA or in their conference tournament. Just win that and you're guaranteed to be in the NCAA tournament. But down in the comments, just let me know 
if you agree with the teams that I made as my locks that should be in and on the outside looking in, uh, share, uh, subscribe, and follow us on Twitter at Sporticus300. Definitely for your chances to win our giveaway. But you guys have a blessed day and we'll see you guys next time.